Hello friends, Tony here, welcome. In this video I'm going to create the layout for our project and for that I'm going to use a component file. So uh, Laravel components refer to a reusable piece of code specially designed for your application's view, built with Laravel template engine Blade. And these components encapsulate the UI elements, promoting code, maintainability and the dry, don't repeat yourself principle. And we can create a component with terminal or directly on inside the views we need so here we need to create a directory named components and inside there we can create a blade file and that blade file is a component or we can also create with the terminal using the artisan command so if i say php artisan and just say list for now to show you scroll up where we have make a component yeah here we have make component so create a new view component class this is going to create also the php class file and the blade file so let's see if i clean this and let's say php artisan make colon component and let's name it a test component if I hit enter, the component created successfully and let's see, inside the app we have now this view directory and inside we have components and here we have the test component class. Okay, so this is a PHP class, has a construct method and also a render which is going to return the view components.test-component. Okay, so that command has created this class and also the this view which is inside the views components directory and this blade file which has only a div an empty div so with that php artisan make component we have created two files the class component and the blade component now this is if we have to make some uh, logic here but for the layout we don't need to make a logic we just need to move the HTML structure. So let's delete this view and also I'm going to delete the components directory and just show you one more time. So if I clean here and let's say PHP artisan make colon component test component, but now I'm going to say add the flag here dash dash view, which means it's going to create only the view, not the class. Hit enter component created successfully. And now, as you can see, in app directory, we don't have the view directory anymore, but we have the, inside the views, we have this components directory, and here now we have the blade file. Okay, and this is the Laravel component. Now I'm going to delete also this one and create right here. So right click, say new file, and I'm going to name it layout dot blade dot php hit enter and now what i want to do is just uh, add the structure so i'm going to say cml5 and let's name let's add the title laravel 11 tutorial okay i'm going to save this and now let's reuse this one in the all the files so i'm going to start with the welcome okay so here we just return h1 and then we have some forms so if i open here and the forms was for the demo so i'm going to remove all of them and just leave the hello world so refresh now we have only the hello world now instead of using the doc type html and the html structure we can use that component here and how we can do that by saying x dash this is the component tag and the name of the component which is in this case is layout so let's say layout and let's close and inside here we can add anything we want so for example i'm going to add the h1 saying uh, welcome or welcome page let's save and let's see here if i refresh nothing showing here and why is that 
because in the layout blade we have not specify where this is going to be rendered okay so the has fun and we can do that by using the special keyword dollar sign slot so double call braces because we use blade and then dollar sign slot which means here is going to be rendered anything we put inside the x layout now if i save that go here and refresh now we have welcome page okay because we added here welcome page also we can add uh, a paragraph here let's suggest testing let's save come here and refresh now we have a paragraph testing okay now let's use this x layout in all of our files so here i'm going to cut the h1 and select all remove and use the x dash layout close that inside here i'm going to say post edit page save close this close also this one go to uh, show blade here i'm going to copy only the h1 cut select all and use the x dash layout and inside we can add what we want so post show page also let's see the create copy this cut this and then select all and remove and use the x layout paste it here save and i think we are okay edit index we need to do the same thing so i'm going to cut this and select all remove and use the x layout paste that in close the x layout and let's save also on the show yeah we have used that and the welcome and now we are okay so if i come here and refresh let's uh, change the url to post okay now we, we have post index page my name is alfred and so on we have a list of posts so now we have more clean blade file by using that component which we named the layout okay friends that's it all about this video i hope you enjoy and if you like such a videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and see you in the next one all the best thank you very much